Hey everybody, um, so in this problem we have a rifle with a barrel of 60 centimeters and that seems to be irrelevant to the problem. The rifle fires a 10 gram bullet with a horizontal speed of 400 meters per second. And the bullet is going to strike a block of wood and penetrate to a depth of 12 centimeters. So that's a displacement. And the problem asks you to calculate the resistive force, assuming that it is constant, that stops the bullet. So the final velocity, because it stops, is zero meters per second. So force is equal to mass times acceleration. We have the mass over here. We don't have the acceleration, but we can calculate it with this information over here. So we can use this kinematic equation so we solve for the acceleration The final velocity is zero. The initial velocity is 400 meters per second squared. The displacement is, is 12 centimeters times two. So 0 0.12 meters and can use a calculator this is meter squared second squared this is meter so we can get rid of this one and that one. Then we get one, two, three, four, five. And this is negative. We have the negative over there. So we have the mass over here, we have the acceleration. So the force is going to be um, 0 0.01 kilograms if we want our answer to be in newtons uh, times the negative 6.66 times 10 to the 5 meters per second squared. So we get that I'm gonna get rid of this one. That the force is six thousand six hundred and sixty six point sixty six newtons. And then uh, we have to calculate how long the bullet takes to come to a rest. So 
So you can use this kinematic equation. We know that the initial velocity is 400. The final velocity is uh, zero. The acceleration is this over here. And the time, that's what we want. So we solve for the time. Uh, final velocity, zero. Initial velocity, 400. Acceleration, uh, negative 6.66 times 10 to the 5 meters per second squared. Meters and meters, second squared go over here. So we get the seconds, and so you have, you have the negative and the negative, so this becomes positive. And you get that the time is Six times ten to the negative four seconds, which sounds reasonable. Pretty, uh, pretty short time, but it's a bullet. So there you go.